tonight on the channel, one of the best old school medium tanks, the Panther II. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to Panther 2 gameplay. Yep, thought I'd take another look at this tank. I'm not fully spaded yet, but we're getting there. So, the Panther 2 is a rank 4 vehicle, about around a 7.0. And in his day, it was the best medium tank in the game, and everybody wanted it. Now, not so much because of the leopards and everything else, but yeah, still a great tank. So, we have two games for you. This is for the Finland map. We'll see more of this later. Uh, but the first match is here at the main map. So, pushed it forward a bit. And yeah, we've got in the back of C. And this is not a, like an ace match or anything like that, but it's quite interesting. I hope you like it. So, first target is a Centurion Mark 10. We see each other, he backs straight off. But he's made the mistake of putting Bush on his tank. So Bush is good if he's staying still, but here you can see, I can clearly see him, no problem. Yeah, I'll see it, the bushes before I see the tank. So it gives me a bit of advantage. It's a bit of a mix and standoff here. We've both seen each other. He's waiting for me to push forward, he's shot. But I can't get up there quick enough to beat his reload. This tank is great though. Armed oh, with an a 8 mm KWK-43 cannon. 50 rounds at disposal. Also back to buy a 7.92 MG34 in the coaxial. Of course, you can see on top of the turret is the rare uh, night vision, which is absolutely useless. Does nothing. It just gives you tank away. Just a pain in the arse. But never mind. This has a turret rotation speed of 9.9 degrees a second. It isn't too slow. Not too fast, but yeah, it's workable. We have a vertical gun, so gun depression of a uh, minus eight degrees. Not as much as Centurion has, but here he goes, poking over. We put a shot straight in his gun barrel. Nice. He's now screwed. He can't shoot me. He pops his smoke. He's backing down the hill, trying to get out of the way. And I think, sod that. I'm chasing after him. He's shooting me. I did shoot in the dark there. A bit daft. But he can't shoot me until he starts repairing. But right in front of him. Shot in the front. Amarak explosion. Take him straight out for my first kill. Nice. This has a reload rate of 11.1 seconds per shot. I did panic there a little bit because I know there's people up top on that ridge. I thought, crikey, let's get out of it. So we're pushing forward, we've got the hill. Looking to my left hand side. I need more targets. When we shot the side, because this is quite weak in the flanks. Nice to at the front. Good armour at the front. It actually has 100 millimetres of hull armour to the front. Six to the sides and 40 to the rear. But it's heavily sloped to the front. Turret armour. 120 to the front. 60 to the side and rear. So it's quite a nicely heavily armoured tank. Consider it's a medium tank. So it's quite hard to take out. It is a 47 tonne tank. But it still has a top speed of 60 kilometres an hour. So it gets there quite nicely. Nice bit of climbing rate and everything else. A good all round tank. Everyone else the Panther 2. There's nothing not to like, really, is there? Good armour, good firepower, good mobility. Here we go. SGR V, here we go. Easily defined by his rockets. Shot in the side of the turret for our second kill. Take him straight out. Very nice. Now we're up here on the ridge with advantage points. The sea looks clear. Nothing pushing up there. I'm going to look down here, this is where the spawn point is, we're going to come around from the spawn point. I see nothing. Now, always remember to use your binoculars. And the C button works out quite nicely too, to keep your turret still, but still look around quickly. Here we go, target. He's down the bottom there. Not enough gun depression. I've got to push it over the ridge a little bit. I've been hit by something, but take your shot first. Hit him. Strength him rack again. Another Centurion Mark 10 down. Third kill. Now he's up here behind the server. Hill. Well, what they call it. Rise. There he is. He's actually Carnarvon. 
put a shot into him, it ricochets. He hits me back, takes my gunner straight out. Git. So I'm back up behind this hill again, just to repair. Well, get him back up again. Now really, he should be pushing forward and finish me off, but he didn't. And we take him straight out. We go straight for the turret ring. Kills his crew. Fourth kill. Very nice. Carnarvon down. Now the Panther 2 is quite nice because people are actually quite scared of it. It's got a very good reputation. And people do tend to panic when you appear. Use this to your advantage. And that you'll do a right it. That split second can mean the difference between them aiming properly and just donking the shot into your turret. Let me fall in. Come on, get this hill. Get up the hill. You can do it. Come on. Come on. There we go. Lovely. So we get on the top here. We've got a great view. See across the map. And the problem is that there's no bugger else to see anymore. The game from this point onwards is pretty much a camp fest. And uh, yeah, nothing much else really happens. I'll get four kills. I'm quite sure for that. I'm very happy to survive that up the hill bit. We take the, the high point. And uh, yeah, we win the game. So we're going to cut now to the results screen. And uh, uh, yeah, let's see what goes on. So here we go. Finish the map. We win. Second place in the team. Four kills. Not a bad match. So the results screen. We've got a few silver lines, not many. Nine and a half thousand. That'll do. A bit more to my crew replacement. And a bit more to the young players at four stroke five. A bit of tank record times one. Shadow stroke streak times four. And one shot times two. That will do for me. The guy above me got seven kills. Look, very nice. I got four. And they've got three more between two other people. So, second match. Here we are on the Finland map. Now, a bit of a funny story. The A point is right over the other side. Been captured by us already. I followed these three guys down this side, thinking I could do some flanking. And it worked out alright, actually, it didn't. Hope you enjoy this match. This is the second match of the video. So we're going to hide over here first, thinking that someone might come around to try to do the same idea as put the enemy. And I thought, yeah, hide in here. But these guys here are out in the open anyway, so there's no point hiding. There's ping in the map there, but I'm not going to go through that way because it'd be dead when I get there. Now, someone's shooting over here. I don't know what it was. Let's go and investigate. I think Panther 2 does have a good top speed of 60 kilometers now, so flanking maneuvers are very worthwhile. Hello. Missed it, damn it. You can get a wave coming around the long way and still get in the fight afterwards. Not like being in a heavy tank. That's M56, I do believe. We do get hits onto him. Come on, reload, reload. Ow. Shot a second too late there to get the kill. Did get a kill assist, that works. A few more uh, respawning points there for me. Very nice. As you can see, the top speed of this thing kicking in quite nicely. Got on the road, 31, 33. Yeah, we're not, we're practically off road here. And we're still getting another 30 kilometres now, so we're coming around quite nicely. I mean, if you're on a road going downhill, then you get 60 kilometres now, no problem. Right, I'm not going for the spawn point here. I'm going to take a left, come down this road, and try and get behind the guys. Pushed up the centre of the map. That was the idea anyway. Doesn't really work out like that. Never does, does it? So one of the secrets of the War Thunder is to plan where you want to go. And stick to it. I have no idea who he's shooting at. I'm sure it's very nice. There's nothing here. Well, there's smoke down there. I can see nothing. Damn it. Might be able to see. Ah, oh, here we go. 
There's a Persian. Or oh, super Persian, is it? Shots away. It ricochets. You're having a giggle, aren't you? You lucky git. Just as it are. Just gets behind that rock just in time, look. Now, can we get from here? Yes, we can. Got the fire. Engine down. Transmission down. Excellent. Let's pull back to reload. They can't shoot me. T44 is harassing him from the side. Wow. He shot me in a bounce up for turret. Nice. And we finished him off. Through the engine deck. Take his crew out. You see that roof bounce back off the front armour? Nice. First kill. Right, I'm going to push forward now. Head towards the A point. Because that's where the action's going to be. Hopefully some enemies left when I get over there. Hit the tree. Not a good idea. Smoke over here. Oh, the captain's own look. Where are they? I can't see him. There's someone shooting behind that rock. Look. Now, if you look, there's three lots of machine gun fire coming from there. It's either a T34 or a T29, I reckon. It's got to be one of them two, isn't it? We're against America's anyway. So I'm pretty sure it's one of them big heavy tanks. We can take them out quite nicely. So this is a very, very capable tank. It will kill a T29 or a T34. I did see one guy here. Where is he? Behind the trees. There he is. M46, I think it is. Yes, it is. <laughs> straight from the front. Takes him straight out. So, there must be another tank around the corner still. Because that wasn't him shooting his machine gun. There's got to be a... Yeah. One of them two T-34s or T-29s behind here somewhere. There he is. Hold you. Wow, straight for the side. Finish him off for the third kill. Nice. Double strike as well. T-34 down. That works out rather well in my favour, I do believe. He didn't see me, but just that quick snapshot worked lovely. These shells are very nice. Of course, they're German shells, so nice, I suppose, the content. All target in the open. Inside. Ruined him nicely. Take his gun out. Gun out and loader out as well. They drop artillery around us. Now where has he gone? He's moved forward. No. Just a bit, bit of judgment there. Just to see if I can get a shot in. I'm trying to spot every. There he is. I've got him in target again. For the side. Finish him off. Nice. Fourth kill. Another T-34 down. Lovely stuff. Now we've got target here, T-95, look, from the side. Shot in the side. Take his track off. He's still got one left. I think he's already repairing, not moving, is he? Hit him again, non penetration. Hit him right on the spare track, look. Bit of adjustment of fire. Hit him again. Track again. Oh my days. Come on. Let's try again. He's on fire. And we finish him off. Nice. I'm getting taken out in return. My turret's gone. But there was five kills. So there is an ace match. Happy blooming days. Right. Oh crap. Um, yeah. Plane down. It's a bit of back. That guy's just died. There is also a M46 over there as well. I just saw him. There he is. He's shooting. We are repairing. We have our 15 seconds to go. Guns back up. Let's get the turret back up again. We're in, we're in business. We've got an ace match, so I'm very chuffed for that. It's not hard in this tank, but this is a good tank. It's very, very forgiving tank, I shall say. You can get them into dodgy situations and get away with it. Right, just try and find this git. Where is he? Ah, that might have been him right there. I think he just died. Bugger it. 
bloody planes. Wow. 33 seconds to make a repair. Well, sort that. We will skip this part. And go straight to the uh, action. There we go. As if I'm magic. That's the gear that bombed me earlier. I have two crew left. It's not good. There's a driver and a gunner left, and that's it. It took my tracks off my gun turret and everything. Oh, blimey. Right, so we're going to push towards their spawn point now. Because that's where they're coming from. They've got to capture the point to win. We're winning on points. They have to come this way. So I hope we can intercept them quite nicely. It must have been that big and their uh, night vision thing on top. It does give you away quite nicely to what tank they're fighting against. Also, it's quite hard to hide behind rocks. You can never go hold down properly, can you? I'm using the old binoculars to see anyone snooping about. Make sure you use binoculars all the time, chaps. You, you know by now. Binoculars are key. Keep your head on a swivel, keep looking. Find them targets, spot them. Pull the gun on target. Hopefully get the first shot in. Is that by there? Or is that a rock? It's a rock, isn't it? Yeah. So nice climbability up the hill. Not much problem. As you can see from the map, there's already someone there camping nicely. Which isn't very nice thing to do. It's probably been there half the blooming game. God, that guy scared the crud out of me. I saw the tank first in the name second. Hello. M19. Come on. There you go. Shots away. He's dead. Now, fair enough, he was in the spawn. But I haven't been here all game. We've captured the zone. No one else to kill. And there are yeah. So you might as well. There's a T34 here somewhere, because that T44 just died. Just gotta find him now. I can he see him? So it's pretty much it for this match anyway, if we're here in their spawn. So they've lost. We've won. We've got six kills so far. So I'm quite chuffed with. Ace match. So be sure to leave a like down below. It helps out a lot. Also, please comment. Know, let me know what you think and what you want to see on the channel. Oh, nice. Bounced it. Ah, what a good one then. Damn it. Yeah, let me know what you think down below. And uh, yeah, what you want to see on the channel. Any requests, that sort of thing. Questions. Yeah, just write them down below. I shall be sure to read them and reply. Also, if you're near around here, subscribe for more. Getting closer now to uh, 2000. We are going to have a little bit of a giveaway. I think it's a premium pack or something. So if you are subscribed, you'll have the chance of winning that. I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but yeah, I'll think of something. We do get a shot for his main turret there. And we win the game. First place. Very nice, two with six kills and one assist. That works. So to the results screen. Bit better. 40,000 silver lions. First place in the team. And a fair few awards. We get a crew replacement look. Lovely. So we're going to run the next thing now. So what do we get? Starting off Avenger. Double strike times two. One shot. Terror squad times two. Special Tom's 6, Shazam Street Tom's 5, Survivor, and last but not least, Heavy Metal Fury. Very nice indeed. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Hope you liked the Panther 2. Thank you for watching, and uh, yeah, I will see you next time.